Alrighty, so, um, I was basically just gonna post this video tomorrow, but I'm just gonna, you know, I'm like, whatever, why not post it, you know, before I go to bed? I mean, it's like pretty much 10 o'clock at this point, but whatever. Um, I could risk, you know, waiting two hours to get gameplay, but whatever. But anyways, um, today I'm gonna be telling you guys a crazy story before I go to bed. A um, long time ago, during middle school, on a field trip. And so grab your snacks and enjoy this story. So basically, during middle school, I had this field trip that... I had this field trip that my science teacher was planned for that was planning for us to go on and it was it was kind of cool I mean not not that much that we don't go on field trips anymore we don't really go on field trips anymore considering we're in middle school but the science teacher you know liked our class so much you know that she wanted to take us on a very special field trip before field trip before spring break so um she gave us you know these permission slips and obviously I signed it you know some of my friends I made during science science class, you know, they were very cool. They were very cool. So, you know, um, we wanted to, you know, um, go on the field trip together. So we both signed the paper. So anyways, the next day pulls around and we're basically getting on the bus to go to the field trip. And this field trip was basically to a park about construction and, you know, all about, you know, all engineering and whatever because this was an engineering class but my science teacher teach engineering and you know um science at the same time which engineering was our our free other period that we can choose from like the it's like the extra period but um so we were on this trip the bus was fun the bus was fun but but like me being like you know sh um putting on music i, I told the bus driver I told the bus driver, yo, could I turn on some music, like, with my speaker, and then the si my side teacher's like, um, actually, how about we just, you know, stand here in silence, I'm like, man, you have to ruin the fun, um, alright, I guess this is how I gotta go, huh, you don't, you, you don't want to rule, you don't want to, you know, have some fun, turn on some music, but I mean, like, I, I mean, I, I, I can understand why, you know, some people might not, you know, want to hear some music on the bus, you're basically just trying to watch, you know, a video, Maybe like some Dan TDM or maybe um, a Pokemon um, guy um, opening Pokemon cards or Moist Critical or whatever. And then all of, a sudden, all of a sudden you just hear music blasting. It's like annoying, but whatever. Fast forward, we get to, you know, the place and um, this place, um, there's like fun activities. Um, there's a scavenger, there's a scavenger hunt that our, you know, our science teacher... I mean, our engineer, engineering teacher, I'll just call my engineering teacher the science teacher because, you know, she does both jobs. But the science teacher, you know, signed us a, a, a scavenger hunt. And at the end, we can choose like two prizes and which were at these tables. So fast forward because, you know, the scavenger hunt's boring aside from, you know, um, me obsessing over keychains, you know, the locks and stuff at, at, the, at another sta station I have like freaking like four keychain locks a gold one and then you know a black one i was just using my imagination but like all right guy alrighty so i have this black keychain that can unlock all the normal chests while I have the gold keychain that can unlock the treasure chest or whatever i was just using my imagination as the creative most creative person on the planet me boss hand but whatever so we get our prizes and because you know me at uh, me and my other friends as a group we decided to get like uh, the construction you know va vase things not the vase but like you know like the shirts or whatever the construction um, worker you know vests that you, that you wear when you're construction like you know the things whatever but we you know we all chose there well, we all chose to wear those because we wanted to be the construction um group whatever so we wear them on and everyone now already knows us that we're the construction um guys because we're literally just we literally just yell that out yell that out loud but we kind of get a little bit hungry so so we went to get some food and we have all all of us had about like what like 50 dollars to spend and um including me which was 70 dollars so we wanted to eat somewhere on oh, my tv's playing music in the background I don't know if you guys heard that, but whatever. So anyways, we went to get some food, and there's this food truck trailer. And we and we were like, oh, 
yes, now we can get some actual food. I mean, yes, there's vending machines, but I mean, we're very hungry. So we went to this, um, we went to this food truck and we see this lady that's kind of yelling out loud. And we can and we can start to hear that because I mean we're kind of far a little bit far from the food truck, so we started you know getting closer, and then we and then we can realize something, right? We realize that what that this person that's yelling at the employee, this person is a Karen. Now, also I don't know this person's name, but we're just gonna call this person the Karen because you know Karens just like to yell at yell yell at employees saying. I want to see the manager. This is not a, an illegal place to sell food or whatever. This is not an example, but this Karen's yelling at the employee of how, um, how, how, why are you guys running out like this type of food or whatever? And we're like, oh, great. We, we're just so hungry, but now this Karen has to, you know, ruin all this stuff. But of course, there's no manager, it's a food truck. Who the heck has a food ma- has a food manager in the truck unless it's a driver or whatever, but infor- but like some powders a manager, and then the Karen's like, let me see your manager or whatever. So then the manager uh, pulls up is like, oh hello there, what's the problem? And she has and then like I can hear her say, while you know we're waiting to you know to get the food, and she says. This menu doesn't have you guys are telling us that. This food item does not exist. I mean, not exist, but it's not available. And the manager, the manager says back, "Yeah, um, everyone likes this type of food, but unfortunately, it's not here." And I see the Karen's face just turn red, you no, know, just wanting to get this food, but you know, trying to you know come up with something to you know try to you know threat them to make the food. But honestly, you can't make that type of food if you ran out all the ingredients. So. Later on, the Karen um kind of gets a little bit more yell loud, but um you know the person had to call the police concerning of how the the Karen was just too crazy, and at one point at one point the Karen was getting was you know so mad that she tried to you know attack the employee employee and just banged on the glass a window, and she and then she literally. On, on quotes, all right, says, let me get in there. I'll make it myself. And I'm just standing here with my friends and we're like, I mean, I don't know. I mean, I guess you can cook yourself, but like, on um, my, sorry, my notification, but I mean, I guess you can cook. Yeah, but this is not your property, ma'am. This is someone else's property. But eventually, the cops come, come and they just arrest the Karen. And well, they we get our food, and well, we um get back to the site and enjoy our meals. Which for the rest of the day, we had a, a the best school field trip ever. We got experience from a Karen that kind of went crazy, and yeah, that's it. Um, I hope you guys like the story time. And then I know this might be a little bit short, not short, but it's probably like nine minutes long. But anyways, if you got, if you guys don't press the like button, I can guarantee you you'll experience a Karen that will interrupt your day. I'm wanting to get to in and out in an hour or something. But yeah, um, this is Boss Man. Um, peace. Have a good night.